On 30th September 1993, an earthquake hit villages in the districts of Latur and Osmanabad in the Marathwada region of Maharashtra. What my mind says, we will never stay in these wooden houses. What I think, we will never stay in these old houses. Make houses of tin sheets only. We will never stay in these wooden houses ever. During the quake, the roofs of the houses shake. People fear that the roof may fall down. So, only during the day, they come and eat at home. And in the night, they sleep outside on the road. Now, we need to strengthen these houses. This is not a new practice. All over the world, there has been strengthening of bridges, buildings and industries. Strengthening of the walls for delamination. The hole should be dumbbell shaped. It takes 10 to 15 minutes to make one hole. Make a header by putting a steel rod in the hole and filling it up with concrete. Finish it with chicken mesh and cement plaster on both sides, strengthening by reducing its weight. The traditional roof in Marathwada, called Malvad, consists of a thick soil layer placed on a timber structure. This layer of soil helps keep the interior cool in summer and warm in winter. But this makes the roof very heavy. The heavier the roof, the greater is the force of the earthquake on it. This can result in its collapse. A push from a heavy roof can also break the wall. So reduce this weight by reducing the soil to no more than 8 inches. A plastic sheet sandwiched in soil may be used to reduce rainwater leakage. Roof strengthening by strengthening of the timber structure. The roof timber structure consists of beams, purlins and planks. It is generally supported on columns. During a quake, the roof on columns tends to sway like a weak table. Sometimes it even collapses. To prevent this, knee braces must be installed between the columns and beams in all possible directions. The bracings can be made from steel angles, steel tubes or wood planks. In case there are no columns, the timber beams must be tied to the roof band using thin wires. These people gave me cement, steel, mud, steel rods and I told the organization that I will bear rest of the expenses myself. Rest of the material like stones I got and improved my house. I started to work on it myself. I have no problems living in this house and I will move in soon. 